嗨，你好，我是 Mary， 很高兴认识你。My name is Mary, and nice to meet you. Today we are gonna learn seven initials and nine compound finals. The finals, if、uh, you learned the single finals before, so the compound finals will be much easier for you. And、uh, we will learn five front nasal finals, and、uh, we will learn the、uh, retroflex final. Okay, <laughs> actually not difficult. And we start from the initials. As I told you before, we don't pronounce initials singly. So L and、um, Uh, I'll end the、uh, uh, final here. So I'll end the e. I'll end the e. Can you can you see? Okay, I the letter I. Hmm. So I'll pronounce j, j, and the second one, ch, ch, and the next one, sh, sh. Okay, and the last one, r, r. So when you pronounce these four initials, j, ch, sh, r, and you need to curl your tongue, make your tongue curly,、uh, over, curl over the tongue, and press it to the, uh, press it to the palate. Okay, j, ch, sh, r. And the beginner, it's a little difficult, especially the last one. But don't worry, don't worry. Later, you can, if you practice more, you can handle it. And the next three one, so I'll end.、Uh, also, I'll end、uh, e here.、Oh, sorry. So it's z z. Your tongue is flat, so you don't need to curl your tongue here. And then c c, and then c c, okay, c c c. So c is a like uh, it's a little like in English, uh, your hands, uh、mm-hmm. huh, hands, and h、uh, a n d s. So it's like D and S together. Z hands. Z, yeah. Z is very easy. It's like cats. Cats. And S is、uh, much easier. School. Okay. Very easy, right? <laughs> and the next one we say the compound finals. Very easy here. So the first one I, I, and then A, A, and then W. Way, all, all, and o, o, u, u, and ye, ye, yue, yue, and then er, er. Okay, curl your tongue. The last one. Okay, and now five front nasal finals. N, N, and then N, N, then Yin, Yin, and then Win, Win, and then Yun, Yun. Next page, we will do the this chart, the spelling. So this one, Z, and we together. Zui, Zui, and then Zhao, Zhao. Then, jo jo. Here, this line and the first tone. We learned the tones tones before, right? And then the second line, I'll end a、uh, second tone. So, zai zai, zui zui, and then zao zao, and then zou zou. So if I end the last tone, if I end the last tone here, the first one. 在 means at or in, so 我在 I am in ah China, so you 在 and the third one I'll end the third line C H line I'll end the third tone. 柴柴 and then 
tree, tree, and then 草，草 ，and then 丑，丑 ，and the C line, C line, and the last term. So 菜，菜，菜 means dish or vegetables. Okay. So if I say um Chinese dish, the Chinese dish. A Chinese um, food, we can say 中国菜，中国菜，中国 means China, and then the last one 脆，脆，and then 草，草 ，and the last one 臭，臭 ，okay. And now the SH line, SH line, and the first term, so 晒，晒 ，and then 睡，睡，然烧，烧，收，收。If I end the third tone about show, so 手，手 means hands, my hands. Okay, 手 And the, the ice line, ah,、uh, and the second tone, 洒，洒 And then 随，随 And then 扫，扫 And the last one, so, so. Okay, the last one, yu line. Yeah, <laughs> it's a little difficult for the beginners, but don't worry. So I am the third term. Rui, rui, and rao, rao, and rou, rou. If I am the last term about rou. If I am the last tone, it's strong and short. 肉，肉，肉 means meat, meat. Or、oh, that's a general, a、uh, general word for all kinds of meat, like chicken and fish and the beef like that. Okay. And now it's our turn. I'll I'll choose them and curate it. How about like this one, and the third tone. Uh、mm-hmm. huh, 很好，非常好。嘴，嘴 means mouth, your mouth. Okay. And、uh, how about this one? And a first tone here. Oh, 非常好 very nice. 超，超 And then the last one. How about this one? And the last tone here. 睡，睡，睡 means go to sleep. 睡 sleep. Okay, this is this is the spellings. And now, so there's a rule for the tones. The tone, you know, the tone mark should be marked above the finals. And when the final, when there's only one final, so just put the mark there. And when the final is a compound final, the tone symbol is usually. Marked above the main vowel. What's the main vowel? We will do it according to the order from a, and then o, and e, e, u, u. So according to this order. If if I have a a here, we will mark we will mark on a like this one. See, we mark here. We mark it here. So jai jai. And then chai, chai, and then hai, hai. The mark is here. And when there's no a, the but there is o or a, so you can mark on o or a. So mark here. You you need just need to remember. I will will mark it according to the order. And we and the same time up here, e and wu we will mark the last one like chui, chui. And shoe, you can say I mark here, here. I mark on the last one. Okay. This is how we mark the tones. And now about the retroflex final. The final e and r is usually attached to another final to form a retroflex final. And then when it used, it is no longer an independent syllable. A retroflex final is represented by the letter r. And it will be added to the final, like 玩花 Actually, for this retroflex final, it always used in the northern parts of China. 
northern parts, like especially in Beijing. For Beijing people, the retroflex final is <laughs> they used very often. And now, so let's do some. Okay. Oh, sorry. And the one and the er together. When we write it, we will write like this. So war, war, and then hua and er together. Hua, hua, and then na and er together. Na, na means there, and then the last one. Zhe and er so zhe, zhe, zhe means here. Okay, this is um, the retroflex final. If you find it difficult at the beginning, you don't really need to practice it because uh, it won't be used in the southern parts actually. <laughs> okay, uh, this is what we learned today. We learned uh, seven initials and uh, some compound vowels. Okay, I'll give you a recording and you can practice it after class. If you have any question or have any difficult to pronounce the initials or finals, you can send me email. And uh, see you next time. Thank you. Thank you. Bye. Bye.